uh, we're gonna start with conveyor lesson one so it'll be basic conveyor operation example accumulating type so we start so we need to do a conveyor as if we are in a manufacturing plant that move bicycles from one place to another so we have here basic conveyor accumulating type okay create advanced transfer station we're gonna do it one step at a time access conveyor Okay, another station. Okay, advanced process, delay, advanced transfer, exit, where basic process, dispose. So we're gonna start with this first one. It's like bikes arrives. Okay, we have here bikes. Random expo of one every hours. And enter arrival station. Okay, we have here arrival. Okay. Access assembly station. Okay, bike conveyor queue and cells. We'll come back to it in a second, but leave it as a one to start with. So convey way to finishing area and here finishing station okay so we have this one is the finishing area and finishing station okay this one has to be the same name as the one we mentioned here it's finishing station and we have delay, delay for unloading. Okay, we have 0 0.25 hours. And here, exit conveyor. Okay, and conveyor name is bike conveyor. By default, it's equal to 1. And we dispose the system. Uh, system bike exit so so next step would be and bikes sh shipping okay so the next step next step would be to go to advanced transfer segment okay so we have here bike segment arrival station and the next station is finishing station and the length is 10 okay 10 unit of measurement and we'll come back to it in one second so we have the bike conveyor the segment is by segment accumulating like keep one accumulating on the system like add one on top of another or one that push the others velocity is one per hour velocity is one one unit of measurement per hour and in case we have 10 cells 
when we if we go back to the segment we write here 10 which is 10 unit of measurement and the conveyor will do one unit of measurement per, per hour so the conveyor they need 10 hours for the bicycle to move on uh, the conveyor and we have here one cells which is the same as here conveyor name okay one cell so it will occupy one cells on the conveyor okay so if we go back we need here station arrival station and segment but before the segment we need another station which is finishing station and segment the so distance between the two okay so if you run we save it if you run the program we and without segment one has been defined without first being okay it's true excuse me so we just have, have to make like segment okay voila okay so that goes really slow and basic process entity okay picture so we bike and so we have as entity picture and one is pushing the other and we need around ten hours to 